Beginner's Guide to the Pontee of the Sandia Mountain Information Station. Beneath the Sandia Mountain, on the eastern edge of Albuquerque, New Mexico, in the United States of America, lies an extraterrestrial facility managed by a star nation from Zeta Reticuli II called the Pontee. The extensive Sandia Mountain Information Station complex lies two miles deep and was retrofitted into an ancient tunnel system already in existence. It has been managed by the Pontee for the past 15,000 years and acts as an information hub for extraterrestrials from all over this galaxy and beyond who come to visit our planet's northern and western hemispheres. It is one of four land-based information hubs on Earth managed by the Pontee. There are four deep ocean aquatic information stations as well. The Ponte homeworld is Pontel. It is the fifth planet orbiting the further of the two stars of the binary system Zeta Reticuli and is approximately 40 light years from Earth. It is also an ocean world and is only slightly larger than Earth, with a higher percentage of large freshwater lakes versus saltwater oceans. There are several nations from the general area of the constellation Reticuli that look similar and who possess bigger heads, large dark eyes, and slender body types. The Ponte are the shortest of those nations that visit our planet and average about four and a half feet tall. They are naturally nocturnal. Their eyes have two lids one similar to our own, as well as a second retractable dark lid that acts as a light filter and protective barrier. Their irises are larger than ours and come in shades of blues, greens, browns, golds, and violet. Their retinas are able to process visual information that earth humans' eyes cannot. Their night vision is excellent and nearly full color. Communication with them is almost 100% telepathic and includes some hand gestures. The Ponte are considered a neutral nation among other star nations. Many star nations visiting Earth tell us that we live on one of the most beautiful water planets in this part of the galaxy. When asked why they are here, their first response is, it's all about the water, and explain that 75% of the extraterrestrial visitors to Earth do not come to visit us. Instead, they come because of the abundance of water here to explore our oceans and to communicate with the sentient nations that live beneath the surface. The Ponte and the Federation to which they belong inform us that big climate shifts are rapidly descending upon us. With the increase of dramatic changes that now face our planet, all of these interstellar intergalactic nations are aware that we Earth humans are running out of time and are going to need some help again. They wish to introduce themselves before things become critical. To facilitate this process, and because many star nations communicate via telepathy, in December 2017, the Ponte asked for a beginner's guide to improving telepathic skills written by them be published online. The Telepathy 101 Primer is now available as a free download at officialfirstcontact.com. Private citizens from all over the world who have studied it and applied its guidelines 
are now receiving in-person CE5 contact and reporting back with evidence, also available to view on the website. In May of 2015, Commander Tealcom, the manager of the Sandia Mountain Information Station, requested a social media account because they wished to teach. Staff at the station using the Twitter handle at Sandia Wisdom responded to a variety of questions in detail via two local telepathic translators, Sue Walker and Reverend White Otter. A handbook for hosting CE5 events written by them entitled Inviting ET, based on information provided by the Ponte, has also recently been published. The archive of over 90,000 plus tweets shared by the Ponte about themselves and their culture is searchable on officialfirstcontact.com. Commander Tealcom, manager of the Sandia Mountain Information Station, Tani, author of the Telepathy 101 Primer.